Hello, in this tutorial I want to show you how to generate random numbers and if we are there because it's a very short topic we made a very simple game ok let's get started we need a few new header actually two of them include cfddlib and uh, include ctime ok we need a ctime to seed the random number generator which is uh, which can be found here ok now generate a random number so in I equal actually first we want to seed the random number generator so s rand and we want to pass the time null the time null is actually the time in seconds from 1970 it is actually the unix time if we are right out that so just count the time null and line okay just write out if we compile the program and run it oh run it we could see that it goes up every second it is the seconds from 1970 okay and we pass, the, pass it to s run because it's uh, changing okay the changing number so it could be a good seed for a random number generator okay and uh, in i equal rand we pass the module sign and the number the range so 100 for example and that will give number uh, 0 to 99 if we want 1 to uh, 100 add plus 1 to that okay and write it out because we will not know else so ran uh, i add the new line the s rand is needed only once in the program ok compile the program and run it oh i didn't save it i always forget to save the program before compile ok 342 you can see it gives a uh, random number uh, almost random number because it's changed only one second so, but if we run the program in every one second it will give some random number to us okay next uh, write our simple game that I mentioned call this random okay and make another integer variable like guess okay um, delete this line and make a loop for example while true this will be an endless loop and actually not really endless because we will break out if we find the correct number okay uh, count actually right here write a number actually it was a good place right here like that write a number and we read it to the guess variable Re uh, thin to the read variable like that okay and if the guess is bigger than uh, the random number we generated we write out uh, start with a new line that uh, it is too big 
it is too big and make a new line else if the guess is less than random I see I mistyped that here if less than random then write out it's too small obviously it's too small as the as is when it uh, is equal obviously because there is no, not bigger there is not smaller so it should be equal then break okay we don't use the uh, code blocks right here because uh, as you can see there is just one line of code in here okay break out from the while loop and write out congratulation the number was uh, actually start with a new line congratulation the number was uh, and uh, it was random or guess it is uh, uh, not matter which one do we write out because it's contained the same number at the moment okay and that is that is our very simple program and if we compile that uh oh there is something problem here to line 16 Oh, it's not read. I don't know where the read comes. It guess, not read. Okay. And run the program, write the number 5. It's too small, obviously. Then 50. It's too small, 70. It's too big, 60. It's too big, so 55. It's too small, 57 and that's it 57 and I forget the new line again oh don't the, uh, no problem so forget this little mistake I just want to demonstrate how to uh, search error in your program so usually there is the program name uh, there is the name of the file which contains the error in this case we or we just have one file but we will make more file in the future okay there is the line number uh, that is where sh you should search uh, the mistake and uh, there is no such overloaded operator and usually you will get a much simpler error message this is just a uh, problem with overloading I write a uh, bad variable here actually a variable that doesn't exist i think the read was something uh, from the io stream or somewhere i don't know i don't use it we use count for write out and sin for read in okay that was the tutorial for today thanks for watching and have a great day